This video features a huge trader, Joe Hall, with lots of holiday favorites for your weight loss journey enjoyment. And I'm including all the Weight Watcher points. If you would like to see what I bought at Trader Joe's, be sure to watch this video. Hello, my name is Patty. Thanks for tuning in to my Winning at Weight Loss channel. If you're new here, welcome. And if you're returning, welcome back. This week we're going to do a huge Trader Joe haul. I hope you enjoy. I have plenty of staple items and some holiday items that might, might just add to your holiday table. First thing I bought is some vegetables. I bought some mix of broccoli and cauliflower. And then this is a bag of broccoli florets. I got a couple of delicata squash. I like to cut those up. Put them in the air fryer. They're very tasty. Put some spices on them. It's like a french fry. Dip it in ketchup. Some olive tapenade for some sub sandwiches. Uh, my husband and son wanted for uh, football this week. And it's an olive, oil, olive spread. It's two points for a quarter cup. And if you just use a tablespoon, it's not bad in points at all if you like olives. But I don't like olives. I got some seasonings, onion, salt, and some everything but the bagel seasoning. Those are two of my favorite spices at Trader Joe's. The teeny tiny avocados I like to buy. I put the avocado on toast with some of the everything but the bagel seasoning. And a little tip is to make sure you weigh out your avocado in grams because you get more avocado for your points. A popcorn with herbs and spices. It's a new popcorn. The popcorn is four points for two cups. My favorite snack is the reduced fat cheese puffs. It is four points for 36 pieces. Tastes just like Cheetos. My favorite, Trader Joe's. I got some dark chocolate stars. They're shortbread cookies. They're very a favorite of the holiday season at Trader Joe's. My daughter Sarah loves these. She's not going to be here this year because she lives in Houston. Hi Sarah, I'll miss you. But I got you some cookies. And these are six points for four cookies. I got some dark chocolate covered peppermint creams. They are three points per candy and I just like to have them out on a tray if you feel like having a peppermint. So I'm going to try these. Some candy cane Jojos. They are three points a piece. Dark chocolate with uh, some vanilla cream and the cream has some chopped up peppermint piece, candy cane pieces in it. So it also is a Trader Joe holiday favorite. Some farfel, I like these noodles. They're uh, boat, maybe called bow ties sometimes. I like them in chicken soup or with some pasta. They're only 99 cents at Trader Joe's. Mini gingerbread people. My son likes gingerbread cookies at the holiday. I got these, they are uh, three cookies are six points. So they're about two points a piece. And they are uh, frosted with a white fudge icing so they look like they're pretty good the bite size everything cr everything crackers are a good all-around cracker to have at the holidays they are good with cheese with vegetables and they are four points for 14 crackers but they're good with uh, vegetables and cheese balls a pep turkey pepperoni Good snack. One of my favorites is to have the Trader Joe light cheese around. It is two points for a half a cup. And that is a three cheese blend of mozzarella, Monterey Jack, and cheddar cheese. Two boxes of Trader Joe's turkey gravy. It is one point for a quarter cup. It's good to have for your holiday meals, mashed potatoes, stuffing, turkey. Speaking of stuffing, I got the cornbread stuffing mix. It is two points for, for a half a cup serving. And you can uh, have all of your fa holiday favorites. You just have to use portion control. The sweet Italian sausage. 
At Trader Joe's is three points per link. And it is very tasty. I like to have it with peppers and onions and you can serve it in sandwiches or just serve it plain. The Trader Joe's fully cooked bacon is three points for three slices. I've had other fully cooked bacon. This is a new one I'm gonna try. I'm sure it's good. All Trader Joe's items are good. I got the light cream cheese. It is uh, three points for one ounce, so an eighth of the package. And you can use it in all your uh, holiday recipes that call for regular cream cheese cut down on some of the points. White cheddar corn puffs. They are uh, four points for two and a half cups. Nice little snacky snack to have from Trader Joe's. Okay, I got some gone bananas, which are chocolate covered banana pieces, and some gone berry crazy with our chocolate covered strawberry pieces. Now these are only one point a piece, and these are two points a piece. So those are good choices. They're the same calories, but different, different uh, points. If you ever had these hold the cone before, these are very tiny little ice cream bars like drumsticks and there are four points for one. I got a chocolate chip one and then a plain vanilla one. Those are a nice little snack. I'm feeling like ice cream. Turkey corn dogs from Trader Joe's. Those are five points a piece and they're very good if you put them in the air fryer and for about 20 minutes they crisp up just like uh, if you took them out of the deep fryer. Some frozen asparagus spears. I never tried the frozen ones before. I usually like fresh but I thought I'd give them a try. Zero points. Vegetable melange is always my favorite. One point per serving which is about three quarters a cup. It's got a little light butter sauce which is why it has point value. Soft pretzels, they are only four points for one pretzel. Good value, they're pretty big. Serve them with some mustard, or if you feel like sweet ones, you spray them with some butter spray and add some cinnamon and sugar. Shredded hash browns, good breakfast food, two points. They're two points for one serving, which is about three ounces. That, that's about a cup and a quarter. Package of reduced Gilt mac and cheese. It is eight points for the whole package. And if you add a bunch of vegetables to it, you will have a hearty lunch. Ground beef, 96% fat free. Always a staple at Trader Joe's. It is one point for one ounce. Frozen Trader Joe's cut white corn. Very good, zero points. Always get those. Their turkey bolognese is sauce only. There's no pasta in here, and it is four points for a half a cup serving. So that is, I'm, gonna, I'm excited to try this one because I've never had it before. These fire roasted bell peppers and onions. There's a red, yellow, and green peppers in it. It's really good, especially with that Italian sausage that I showed, and just serve it up on a sandwich. You could get a two piece point of bread and put a sausage on it and have an Italian sausage sandwich with some of that cheese. And then serve it with a side of fries. The fries are four points for 25 pieces. Bake them in the oven or the air fryer just like the fries we all love. Here's a new an item I try, just tried last time at uh, Trader Joe's. It's the shaved Brussels sprouts. I like to bake them in the oven. I hate, I've always not liked Brussels sprouts, but these are really good. You spray them with some olive oil, put some garlic in it, and bake it in the oven 400 degrees for about 20 minutes. They crisp up real nice and they are very flavorful. So if you don't like Brussels sprouts, these might convert you. And I got a light butter. This is two points for one tablespoon. And this is another staple at Trader Joe's is the orange chicken. It is nine points for one cup. Um, so I don't eat too much of it. Depends on how many points I have for the day, but I always like to get one at Trader Joe's. Everybody likes it. I hope you enjoyed this Trader Joe's haul. 
and comment below on your favorite Trader Joe's item. I'm always looking for new items to try when I go out shopping at Trader Joe's and I may just use one of your suggestions and put it out on my next video. Please subscribe to my channel and make sure you click the bell so you're notified every time I post a new video. Thanks for watching. Remember, we're here to eat healthy, get fit, and be well. This is Patty, and I'm winning at weight loss. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.